2025, this is practical question number three on electricity. We are going to be looking at the use of potentiometer and some other apparatus in determining uh, the current and voltage relationship, which is more or less like an Ohm's law question. Okay, so follow me. Let's go and do the. Okay, so the circuit diagram is going to be like this. You have your OQ, which is your potentiometer, and the voltmeter is connected to it, something like this. Okay, and the rest like that. Now let's. So, this is the setup. See, this is my potentiometer. Here. According to the diagram, that's point O. At that point O, I will have a wire that connects to my jockey. That's my jockey here, like this. And then I also have a wire that connects to the to my ammeter here. And from that ammeter, the other side of the ammeter, it comes to my key. Then to the positive terminal of the battery from the key. Positive terminal of battery. Then from the battery, the negative terminal of the battery, it goes to the heating resistor. Okay. Then the other side, which is side Q, I join it to the other side of the potentiometer. Why the voltmeter here is connected in parallel to you can see it's connected in parallel connected in parallel to the potentiometer as you can see connected in parallel to the potentiometer this way now if you put in my key i'll, I'll be able to take my i naught and v naught which is what the maximum current and the maximum potential difference Okay, so let's try that out now. Now let's take our reading. That is our I naught and V naught. Let's take it, put in the key. Okay, the key is there. Our I naught is 0 0.3. So let's come and record it here. 0 0.30 ampere. I've recorded that. Then our V naught is, this one is, is, is 1. And each of this one is 0 0.05. So it's on two, that should be 0 0.1. That's so this value is what 1.10. So uh V naught is what 1.10 1.10 volts. Okay, with that one done, we remove the key. This is one of your precautions. I ensure that I remove the key every time before every after each read, I remove the key. Now the question now says that we should move our jockey. To what oh, so, that, so that OP this is my P now OP so that OP will be what will be 10 centimeters that means I go from here to this place 10 centimeters so I put it in and I put in my key let's put it in now first 10 centimeters see there 10 centimeters now let's put in the key here the key is there now let's take our reading on ammeter ammeter it is what 0 0.3 0 0.32 yeah 0 0.32 on ammeter and on voltmeter that's one point is on one that's 1.05 yes 1.05 let's remove it yes and we put in the next our key we put in we, we take our jockey rather to 20 say op must be 20 so you put it at 20 here and you hold it down there at 20 you hold it down there and then you now put in your key the key is there let's take our reading on ammeter is 0 0.32 0 0.32 okay it's more than it's okay it's from 0 0.32 it's between 32 and 3, that's 0 0.33. 0 0.33 on this one. And then this one is what? 1.1. 1. 
Hey, your hand is shaking in. One point. One point. Uh, zero five. Okay. No, is it? Yeah. No, one. He's on one now. It's one. Yes. He's on one now. He's on one. Okay. Let's keep it at one. This is at one. One point zero zero. And this one, you don't need to. We move the. We move this one to thirty. Yeah. Thirty. Place it down there. Then put in our key. And then take our reading. This is. Zero point three is checky. Zero point three four. Zero point three. Uh, yes, yeah, 0 0.34 and the other one is 0. Point, so we take two from uh, from 0. Point, no, 0. 0.90 0. 0.90 yes that one is 0. 0.90 this one is 0. 0.3 what um, 40 now at 40 so let's place this one at 40 and then we hold it down there at 40 then we put in the key yeah, the key is there. We take our amateur reading. That is, should be what? Uh, zero point. This is point two three. three no, zero point three two four. Okay, zero point three five. This one is zero point three five. That is our amateur is zero point three five. Vote meter is zero point. Wait. Zero point two. Uh, zero point. Is fluctuating. Okay. Zero point eight five. Zero point eight five, right? Yes. Okay. Zero point eight five. Zero point eight five. This one was zero point three five. Three five. You took yes. it very well. Zero point three five. Zero point. Zero point three five. Zero point eight five. It at fifty as well. Let's put it at fifty. Fifty, and then we put in our key, and we take our reading. Can I take that one. Zero point three six. Zero point three six. Okay, and this one is saying. Oh, this is vote meter. It's not there yet. Vote meter is reading zero point five six mm -hmm. seven eight. Let's say zero point eight. Mm -hmm. 0 0.8 0 0.8 so I'm using 0 0.8 okay let's take that number 3 okay at 30 just want to be sure okay I have one uh, 0 0.2 0 0.32 0 0.32 okay 0 0.32 and then here, what do I have here? We have um, 0 0.85. 0 0.85. Okay. Holy. Okay. So as you can see from my table here, there's a trend. As this one is increasing down, this one is decreasing down. So I have my trend. Though, uh, my, this one is likely odd but it's okay you know we already have a good value so, so i'm just going to keep it that way so we plot the graph of v on the vertical axis and the graph of i on the horizontal axis giving us a negative slope uh, graph